Hello everyone. Today we are going to see matrix and its type. So first we will see what is matrix. Matrix is an arrangement of numbers or of functions in m rows and n columns arranged within open and closed square bracket. Here we have given matrix A with these numbers. In first row we have this is a11, a12, a13 up to a11. This is horizontal line is called the row of this matrix, right? And next in vertical we have a11, a21 up to am1. So we have to call column of this matrix. Okay, so how many numbers here we have? This is here we have total m into n. These numbers are called the elements of the matrix, right? So in general we have to write this matrix aij enclosed within these brackets with these elements m into n. And this m into n is called the order of matrix. This is m by n. That means here we have m rows. These are the rows and these are the columns of this matrix. Okay. So this is matrix having order m by n. And total elements are also this is m by n. Now we can take example here. If we have this matrix A, if we have this is matrix of order 2 by 2. This is 1, 3, 4, 5. So this is here we have 2 rows and 2 columns. This, these are the rows and these are the columns. So this matrix is called of order 2 by 2 having total numbers 4 and these numbers are called the elements of this matrix. So here we have 4 elements. Similarly we can take another example. If we have this is here, okay, so how many rows here we have? This is 3 rows, right? This, these are the 3 rows and 2 columns. So order of this matrix here we have to write first number of rows and then number of columns. Similarly, we can take another example. If we have this is here, this is 2i, 3 plus 7i, then this is 0 and this is 4i. Okay, so this is also the matrix. Here we have taken these numbers are as a complex numbers, right? So all these are the examples of matrix. Now, next we have types of matrix. So first we will see what is row matrix. It is a matrix having only one row. In general, we have to write this matrix A as a having only one row. That means this is 1 by n. Right? 1 represent here number of rows and n is number of columns. So we can take any example here. This is, yes, so this is matrix having only one row. Order of this matrix here, 1 one row and three columns, right? So similarly, if we have another matrix, this is Y here. If we have this is A, B, C, D. Okay, so how many rows here? We have only one row and how many columns? One, two, three, four. So this is matrix of order one by four. So these are the rows having, these are the row matrix having only one row. Now next we have column matrix. So column matrix is a matrix in which we have only one column. Okay, so we have here only one column. So in general we can show this matrix by AIJ. This is Yum by Yum. Here Yum represent rows and one is column here. So we can take one example here. This is Yes, this is column matrix. Again, if we have this is, yes, these are the column matrix. So, order of this here, this is 3 by 1, 3 rows, 1 column here. 
2 by 1, 2 rows, 1 column. Okay. So, next type we have here, 0 matrix. This is also called as a null matrix. In null matrix, we have all elements 0. Right. Okay. So, in general, this matrix we have to show by this one where all elements are 0. We can take example here. Yes, all these are the zero matrix. Okay, now next we have rectangular matrix. So, the matrix in which we have number of rows is not equal to number of columns. It's a rectangular matrix. Okay, if we have number of rows M and number of columns. So in rectangular matrix we have this is m not equals to n. So we can take one example here. If we have this is yes. So this matrix A is of order how many rows here? This is two rows and three columns. So this is a rectangular matrix of order two by three. Okay. Again, if we have this is yes. So, how many rows here? 1 rows and 3 columns. So this is also rectangular matrix. Next, we have square matrix. So, what is square matrix? From this one, we can make an idea. That means, when we have number of rows is equal to number of columns, then we have to call that matrix as a square matrix. We can take one example here. Yes. So, this is here 2 rows and 2 columns. So, this is a square matrix. Again, if we have to take this is. Yes, we have here 1 row and 1 column. So, this is also square matrix. Right. Okay. So, again, if we want this is y is equal to if we take here. Yes, so this is what, this is again square matrix, what is the order of this one? This is here 3 by 3. So in general square matrix is called as a n square matrix. So this is why we have to call it as a 3 square matrix. This is here 2 square matrix, 1 square matrix. So here we have to remember, if we have to write in general this matrix y, in general form of the element, we will write this is A11, A12, A13, A21, A22, A23, then A31, A32, A33. Right. So, what, what does this A11 represent? A11 represents this first element. That means here A11 is here. This is a row and this is a column. Similarly, A12, this is in first row and second column. Right. A23, this is in second row and third column. Okay. So, this Y is here square matrix. Right. So, this elements, this A11, A22, A33, these are the diagonal elements of this matrix Y. Right. So, what are diagonal elements here? Diagonal elements, these are a11, right, then A22, then A33. These are here diagonal elements. And another, these elements are called non-diagonal elements. So, remaining elements, this is where I0 equals to J. These are non-diagonal elements. What is diagonal elements? When we have, this is A, I, J. This is I is equals to J. These are Diagonal elements, diagonal elements, right? And then we have this is A I J, and here this is I not equals to J. So these elements we have to call as a non-diagonal elements. Yes. So we have to remember this is here 
this is square matrix and these elements are diagonal elements and another are non diagonal elements so this is we have seen here rectangular matrix and square matrix difference is that in rectangular we have number of rows is not equal to number of columns and here we have both number of rows and columns are equal yes so we have seen here matrix and sum of its type thank you